As the GOP frontrunner in the race for U.S. Senate, Don Bolduc is under the microscope. This weekend at the Londonderry Old Home Day Parade, he had to tell a supporter driving a vehicle behind his official float to take down his campaign sign because it was next to a Confederate battle flag. The town of Londonderry issued a statement calling the display, quote, disgraceful. And to end last week, the retired Army General came under attack from Governor Chris Sununu, who said he doesn't consider Bolduc a serious candidate. Hey. I'm running my campaign, right? I'm running for the U.S. Senate, and I'm running against Maggie Hassan. I have other Republican opponents out there. You know, they're doing the same kind of things. It's not about them. Uh, it's about Granite Staters, and it's about beating Senator Hassan. Political analysts say a Bolduc victory on September 13th would not be a surprise if you look at how other GOP Senate primaries played out around the country. You'll see Dr. Oz in Pennsylvania, um, J.D. Vance in Ohio, Herschel Walker in Georgia, um, all candidates who are running, who ran sort of bolduc like campaigns uh, and are now having a hard time now that they're facing a general election electorate. But Bolduc says what separates him is his appeal to the conservative base and independent voters. I will go to Washington, D.C. and serve everybody in the state of New Hampshire. In Stratum, Adam Sexton, WMUR News 9.